Wandering Winter here, and... Well, I think I want to hit Wharf, so I'm going to go Silver Silver. Uh, there's Beggar Monastery here, but there's... There's also just... Um... Okay. Getting the Wharf first and delaying the Monastery until we can start getting some Wharves and stuff going. So I'll get the Monastery here. We're just going to try to get a lot of Wharves and a Monastery or two nobles and inns, and play it that way. Okay, this is going to be another wharf for me. Okay, so this could be double monastery. I mean, I probably Look, let's grab an estate, and let's go for just double monastery. We got real thin. We could just trash a little bit slower. We can trash quickly here. I think we can, I think we can. Flip the end in now. Yeah, I just don't really believe in Marauder here. Conspirator is even not something I'm super enthused about. We're going to want to trash this ruined market here, so hence the not. Um, hence the not discarding it. Probably want to trash some extra monasteries now. Nobles basically seems worse than in for quite a bit. Could think about charm at some point. Would probably be good soon, but I probably want like a fourth wharf first. The thing about charm is you can like buy wharf, or you can buy in, gain the wharf off it, and then gain the in and be very reliable that way. So maybe it's actually already time for charm. Maybe it should have been charm last turn even. Okay. Let's go Charm Silver here, trash a couple of these guys. Yeah, this is going to be bad. Hopefully I don't draw two actions here. Yeah, this isn't great anyway. I'm just going to trash the second Monastery now, I think. Could take a Conspirator, but I don't really think I'm set up for it. Well, I get to do this anyway here. And we should be pretty much rolling here. We do have to worry the tiniest amount about piles. Monasteries are somehow low. Uh, estates are at six, and there is a lot of buy. Wharves are kind of low, so need to watch that a tiny bit, but I'm not hugely concerned about it. Mostly just want to keep drawing. Let's 
Let's get this ruined library trashed here. So we want to do it in this order in. Got a wharf. Put these back in. Don't think I want a beggar or anything. I could take a beggar. I should actually have enough terminal space for it. I think. I might be able to react it. Okay, so pile, pile, kind of pile, kind of pile. I might also be able to worm it. Um, we'll see where we are at the end of this turn. We'll probably take it for the money, though. With Monastery, you gotta trash all the coppers back, so it's just like a cheap terminal gold. Yeah, I think I'm just going to do this. So I'm going to need another in here. I probably want... another charm. So we go like charm in province, just to be safe. I actually probably could have kept some of those coppers. Oh well. I do have to watch piles, although. They're not hugely low, I think. I mean, the, the, these guys I can run out basically whenever, but none of the other piles are low enough that I can quite snag two of them, I think. Um, yeah, I'd like to react this. More money, please. And I guess this is the big reason to not do the thing Okay, well, now these piles might be low enough. So I can buy an in, gain two wharves. And we'll see what happens here. Check for wins, six by seven, eight gains. Looks like it's going to be gains short, okay. So in that case, what do we want to do?
probably just go province in, stick the in in. and say I have more wharves this turn so I can draw better. Also, piles be a little bit lower. So I might be able to say play the ruined market and be able to win that way. Having the extra wharf coming in should help quite a bit, I think. And the ruins are even lower. And I don't think you can double province on me here. So... Uh, maybe you can? You could. You could have. But now I think I'm going to win. You get another nobles. I think I can pile out inns, wharves, and ruins here. Oh, I can like definitely pile out inns, wharves, and ruins now. Yeah, I have a lead. It's 12 money, it's 50, it's plenty. Cool. Yeah, um, I might have played the mid game, maybe not the best, but I think the early game was the important thing here. You don't want to open Marauder Monastery. You probably don't really want to open Marauder at all. Like, if these line up, that can be pretty decent, but you want to get to your wharf stuff first and only then go after the monasteries. This is an, a common play pattern, I think, with Monastery where you get drawing a bit first and then you pick up the monastery when it can be more multi-trash. Sometimes you do want to open the monastery, but in a lot of cases, and I think this one, you want to get a bit drawing first and then and then go for the monastery, but it's a little bit of a tricky card like that. Anyway, thanks for watching.